Hey, what's going on? It's your boy, Mr. Locario, the bad boy of the dating game. What's good? So ladies, in this video, I wanted to talk about why men lose interest in women, all right? So I get emails all the time from ladies. They hit me up and they're like, hey, Mr. Locario, I've been seeing this guy for a while and it seems like he's losing interest. He's not calling as much or, you know, I went out on a date, a couple of dates with this guy and then, you know, he hasn't hit me back. He hasn't called me back or, hey, you know, I've been seeing this guy and, you know, we had sex and then after we had sex, he didn't call me and all these other different things, right? So, Women are wondering, like, why are these guys losing interest, right? So this is the thing. The reason why um, a lot of guys will lose interest is because they don't necessarily see value in you beyond sex. See, a lot of women think that sometimes that, you know, if they have sex too quick, this that's the thing that's going to make a guy leave. You know, um, they think that, you know, that's one of the main reasons like, oh, if I would have waited and not had sex with him so soon and then he would have got to know me more and then this and this and that would happen. And that's not necessarily the case. The reason why these guys are losing interest is because they don't see value. And the reason why they don't see value is because they don't see how you're benefiting them beyond sex. Do you understand what I'm saying? So it goes like this. What happens is most women have a what can he do for me attitude versus a what can I do for him attitude, right? Now, when you take the what can I do for him attitude, that's when he starts to see value in you and that's when he wants to continue to see you, right? So if you're dating a guy and let's say, for example, you know, um, you were dating this dude and, you know, y'all been seeing each other for a while and he's um, about to leave work or something, and you say, hey, listen, um, come over. Um, I'm going to, you know, cook you a, a, some dinner. You understand? So he comes over, you cook him a nice meal, and then he's like, oh, shit, like this, you know, she's cooking me some food. This is great. You understand? I was hungry. She went out of her way to actually cook some food for me, and I appreciate that, right? Let's say you're dealing with a guy who's, you know, he's a go-getter. He's real busy. Let's say he's, you know, trying to get his business off the ground, and he just has a whole lot on his plate, and he's like letting, he's talking to you, and he's letting you know, like, hey, He's like, yeah, I got, I got so much to do. I got this to do and that to do. I got to go to the post office. I got to do this. And if you say something like, hey, listen, you know, I know you have a lot to do. Um, I could actually help you. I could take these, you know, uh, envelopes to the post office for you to free up some time so you can do your other stuff, right? So now he's like, wow, like she's actually helping me with the stuff that I need to do. And this is benefiting my life. So then he sees value in you. Again, what can you do for him? You understand? And so the thing is, a lot of times what happens is, is that, you know, you, you ladies are so conditioned to, uh, you know, in the society to where, you know, it's like, OK, well, I'm trying to find this guy that's going to do everything for me, for me, for me. Now, of course, you want a guy who's going to do stuff for you, but you also have to reciprocate and, you know, have the attitude of what can I do for him? Do you understand? Because you doing that is going to uh, show him that you actually can benefit him and he sees you as a woman who uh, has more value beyond just sex. Do you understand what I'm saying? And that's the thing that's going to keep him interested in you because now you stand out, uh, you know, more than the other women that he's probably seeing at the time or just other women in general because you're actually taking time out to do something for him. Do you understand? And so the thing is, when you don't do those things, that's the thing that makes them lose interest. Because if you're just having sex with them and that's it and there's nothing else going on, you're no different than any other girl that he's probably having sex with or could have sex with or whatever. He's like, OK, well, I can, I'm having sex with this girl. I can have sex with that girl. And so but what else are you bringing to the table? You understand? And so that's the thing that's going to sort of keep his interest um, and, and make him want to actually continue to see you because now you become valuable in his eyes. Do you understand what I'm saying? And, you know, he's going to actually have be more interested in you because of that. But the thing is, he will lose interest if you are not bringing anything to the table, if you're not having the attitude of what can I do for him? And the thing is, you know, um, this is something you could do, like when you're actually seeing a guy, dating a guy for a while or whatever, and what you can do is make sure that you're paying attention to what he's talking about and what he's 
uh, into and, you know, certain things in this life. And then you can, you know, implement, you know, yourself in those situations to basically help him out. You feel what I'm saying? Or to be, uh, you know, a part of his life in that way where you're actually benefiting him. And that's going to make him, that's going to make him see you as more valuable um, in his eyes. And that's going to make him be more interested in you. All right. So listen, if you want any more advice on how to attract a man, how to get the right man, make sure you click the link below or go straight to hewantsyou.com. That's hewantsyou.com. And you can get my free audio program, Seven Highly Effective Steps for Finding and Keeping a Man. And that is it. I'm out of here. Remember, the truth is inside you. Peace. I'm gone. Hey, what's up, ladies? I'm dating and life coach, Mr. Locario. I want to ask you a few questions. Are you tired of dating the wrong guys? Are you sick of going on date after date that ends up nowhere? Are you tired of being single? If you answered yes to any of these questions, you need to get my free audio program, Seven Highly Effective Steps for Finding and Keeping a Man. Now in this audio program, it's gonna teach you everything you need to know about finding the right guy and keeping him interested in you. Now all you need to do is click the link below or go to hewantsyou.com. That's he wants you .com. Now don't wait any longer. Find Mr. Right right now.